Hi, folks. This is Don Meisner with the North Country Fishing Report. Well, I got another report from a friend of mine just returned from Afghanistan, was one of our top military people over in that area. It's fortunate, well, I say fortunate, uh, but he's fortunate enough to be back here for a while. And he was experimenting in places that he had never fished before. And one of them was the Indian River. And he sent pictures back to my buddy Rust about some of the wonderful bass that he caught. And what this illustrates is that we have so many waters around us that selecting the best one to go to sometimes is a difficult thing. But here's my recommendation. If you can find waters that don't get all the heavy fishing pressure that some of the more famous spots that are wonderful in our area, sometimes, you know, the more a fish sees a lure, the more it's going to get accustomed and avoid it because it knows it's not a good thing to hit. And it's the same thing with these heavily fished areas. But if you can find an area that most fishermen don't go to, the fish don't see lures very often, you're going to have a lot better fishing. And this is what can occur in our area because we've got so many backwaters, so many little lakes and ponds that might not get all that much pressure that can be fantastic. And the Indian River is only an example of some of these other places that you can explore and you can find fantastic fishing. Until next time, folks, this is Don Meisner with the North Country Fishing Report.